Hey guys, Mary Jam, April 15th at 3.12, <clears throat> so I don't have my vlogging kit because I'm outside. Um, I've just been cooking and putting away the dishes, so I don't think I'd film that. <laughs> but I'll show you guys what I make after we vacuum and stuff. I just tried calling both my parents, both busy, so um, that's why I haven't done a video in a while. Still wake it up too, but we're going to start vacuuming. <laughs> But I'll show you guys uh, what I made later after it. Um, but yeah, just outside smoking. It's actually nice out today. So it's pretty sunny out. Not too bad. Uh, but I don't like the sun. So <laughs> as you guys know. And my allergies are acting up, of course, as usual. Now you can see the mark, so this little mark underneath my eye will always be there. And this on my hand, so that's some speckles, as I keep saying. Sometimes it's hard to to see. And this is a zit, of course. <laughs> but this was a mark from speckles. So I'll always have that. So speckles will always be with me. And yeah, I so still miss my cats a lot. <clears throat> Which is why I'm trying to find uh, the photos so we could do the shadow box because I really want to make that but usually when I uh, vacuum or clean I usually end up finding stuff <laughs> usually but yeah that's why I haven't uh, really done any videos yet I've been watching the Lawrence Brothers podcast of course um, of course you guys know I love Andy Lawrence <laughs> um, but yeah he I was just watching the Hanson Brothers with the, uh, meeting the Lawrence Brothers for the first time, and I can't believe people are actually have a reaction channel for the, <laughs> for the Brotherly Love podcast, that's kind of funny. <laughs> but I was just like, wow, I didn't even watch it, I was just like, that's just insane that somebody's reacting to the Lawrence Brothers and the Hanson Brothers meeting up. Are people that bored with their own lives that they have to react to every small little thing? I didn't get that many views, obviously. It's like at 105 or something. But yeah, I didn't even bother looking at it. It's not... I don't think it's just for the whole podcast. I think it's just for, like, different thing, interviews or whatever. I don't know. It's a weird channel. But I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to even bother clicking on it. <laughs> I don't want them to get the view. So yeah, pretty soon we're gonna uh we call it finish vacuuming. But I'm still waking up, so got a huge stomach ache. So um so lots of cooking today. I just made uh the mushroom mushrooms for my sandwich. Because I, you guys know how much I love sandwiches, but I'm almost out of bread, so soon I gotta make bread. <laughs> I was actually gonna do that, but since I gotta wait for it to arise, but I'm like, no, I'll wait till later. I gotta vacuum first. I keep, that's the problem with me, is that I keep doing, I don't finish what I start. <laughs> but I was like, I know by the time I finish vacuuming, I'm gonna be really tired. Because it's a lot of moving stuff around and all that. So it's like, I know I'm going to want a sandwich. So I'm going to have to have my mushrooms made. Because I've just been eating uh, sandwiches with just lettuce and spinach. <laughs> That's kind of lame. <laughs> it's kind of boring, actually. But, uh, yeah, lots of cooking. But I don't know how long I'm going to be up for. Maybe, like, another two hours, because, yeah, just stomach ache, and I've had a stomach ache for a, a while, though, now. I know a lot of people keep saying I should go gluten-free, but I'm like, to go gluten-free and be vegan, it's really hard. There's not a lot of options. And the other thing is that I don't have a lot of money, so I can't just buy whatever I want. I gotta buy what's cheap, so that's the other thing, too. So, like, because I bake, 
most of my bread and uh what do you call it? sauces and foods like that a lot of it for gluten free you need gluten free flour i'm like i can't i don't want five six different types of flour in my place <laughs> so i don't know but i think like i said my stomach always hurts because of the medication that i'm on it's like every few days um i get a stomach ache and then it goes away so it's not too bad I should be making soup, but that's a lot of, uh, what do you call it, uh, food prep, so, but first I gotta vacuum, I gotta finish what I started yesterday, <laughs> but I was like, I know for sure I need mushrooms, at least my sandwich stuff made, so yeah, just outside smoking, and I've only been up for two hours, and I did do put away the dishes and like I said I made the mushroom uh, sandwich filling which is like it's usually the portobello mushrooms but I've been using the kimene mushrooms because they're cheaper doesn't taste as good but payday is Wednesday thank goodness so Wednesday is going to be a busy day which is why I'm glad I'm home today and tomorrow. And I've been out, like I said, all weekend. So I'm probably going to be sleeping on and off today. And then tomorrow I'll be up all night. <laughs> and then it'll be payday. Yay. So I might do an updated version of where my money goes to now. Because before I did, um, I don't know if you guys saw that video. But I have a video of how much money I get on disability and where everything goes. When I had the cats, now that I don't have the cats, I'm going to redo a new one. Because I do get, actually, at least after I pay rent and the bills and everything like that, I usually have at least $300 now extra. So, without the cats. <laughs> but then I'm also paying for, uh, I'm donating towards the SPCA, I have the Pizap, I get my energy pills. I have lots of things now that I'm supposed to get, so in a way I kind of say, but then I don't. <laughs> oh, and my vacuum cleaner that I wanted is a hundred bucks now. Before it was eighty, so that went up. So I'm still probably gonna get it. I'm just debating when I want to get it. Because whenever I get, uh, like I said, I've gotten vacuum cleaners off Facebook a few times. And then I even paid for a cab to, so I didn't have to carry it. And then it'd break, like, in less than a month. And sure, it was free, but I had to go out of my way to get it. Some of them I had to pay 20 bucks for. So it's like, yeah, no. I'm just going to wait and get Instant Cart to deliver it to me. And probably, uh, get bookshelves from Instant Cart as well, because Walmart probably has bookshelves. I've actually never really looked at the Home Depot section in Walmart, so I might do that on Wednesday as well. Uh, go to Walmart, but we'll see how tired I am. Whew. I did that because Friday um, I usually use Instant Cart right after payday, like on Friday, so then I'll know exactly what I want to get. <laughs> I don't know. Oh yeah, and I gotta print up some more photos anyway, so I'll probably go back to Walmart again. And then maybe I might film the home, home uh, decor. The only problem with that is, like I said, there's always a lot of people around. So it's kind of hard to film in public. At least in Vancouver, like I said, I still don't know how people in the States do it because our stores, we have security everywhere and we have people everywhere. So it's just crazy. <laughs> you guys wouldn't be able to hear me or see me. You'd just be able to see everything else around me. That's why I don't wear hearing aids. 
Because here I am, it's like I said, I keep hearing everything around me rather than what's in front of me. So it's kind of pointless. <laughs> I hear all the fans and small noises that you don't pick up. But, <clears throat> oh, eventually I will uh, get back to doing appointments because I know I do have to get hearing aids eventually. For when my hearing is completely gone, then I'll have no choice. <laughs> I'll have to wear them. But it's funny because uh, fa my family was like, oh, you don't wear your hearing aids and you don't wear your glasses. I'm like, yeah, but then I remember my dentures. But then if you think about it, I got to wear my dentures. I got to wear my hearing aids. I got to wear my glasses. My hearing, my glasses go in between my ears with my hearing aids. <laughs> And it's so much weight on your face. And then I have bottom dentures as well that I could wear, but I don't. I just wear the top ones because it's just so uncomfortable wearing so much stuff when you go out. It's a lot of weight on my face. <laughs> so that's why I'm like, I don't really care anymore. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to get, re get ready to... Uh, start vacuuming soon. I'm just going to finish watching um, some stuff on YouTube. Finally glad that I put away the dishes at least because I'm running out of dishes. <laughs> I'm running out of dishes. So yeah, probably in like 10-15 minutes I'll start recording vacuuming again. And, uh, we'll go from there and see how long I stay up today. I have a feeling I'll probably only be up for an hour. Hour and a half, maybe tops. Because even though I drink coffee, I'm still tired. I mean, I don't want to take, I don't take my energy pills when I'm tired. Like I said, I know I'm tired out from this weekend. It was a busy weekend, so... Got lots done, so Mondays are usually rest and catch-up days, and then Tuesdays is usually when I do lots. So, uh, yeah, just keeping you guys updated throughout my day, and hanging in there, taking one day at a time, but I'm always, always, always in the kitchen when I first wake up, because it's my favorite place, <laughs> and, and... Uh, and my favorite thing to do is to cook, and like I said, I need dishes, I need space to cook, so. Anyways, like, comment, share, subscribe, this one's a short one, because I'm not quite awake yet, <laughs> and I'll talk to you guys when I'm inside, while I vacuum, here on Phantom Stories, Daily Vlogger, Living With Conditions.